five years old and still kind of discovering who I am as a person. Um, and we're like four years old as a band. Uh, we're we're very, still very much like trying to figure out who Juvenile Line is and what we want to accomplish. I think on this last record, we're definitely getting closer to ju who Juvenile Line is and, and who we kind of want to be. I think, I think people gravitate to what they believe is real and is genuine from artists. Music in our generation, like our generation especially, like we've had access to more music than anybody ever. And that's an amazing thing because we're not held back to like just liking one genre. Like my grand, my great grandpa and grandma, like all they did was listen to gospel music, and they love like old, you know, kind of folky Johnny Cash. Uh, but for us, like we we love DJs, and Nate loves um, metal music and punk music, and we also love. Hip hop. I mean, so it's just kind of like, and, and that's the way our generation is. Like, yeah, I feel like everybody listens to everything. Um, we we like love folk music, and we love like the banjo sounds and we love mandolin and we love um, acoustic drums and acoustic guitar but we also like love to dance and we love like the vibe of our community back home is always looking for an excuse to um, have a dance party and, and I feel like hip-hop in a lot of ways like sets people free. I think in a lot of ways like people can relate to the scatterbrainedness of our music that kind of works. Yeah.